Good evening. After an hours long meeting, the HOA for a Henderson neighborhood finally now making a decision on how to proceed following pressure from elected officials. Thanks for joining us here at 11. I'm Denise Valdez and I'm Brian Loftus. 8 News Now reporter James Schaefer speaking with residents and city council members. James, how are they going to take care of this water main break that's been troubling them now for years? Brian, you're absolutely right. This has been plaguing them for years. Residents told me they had three options on the table tonight as to how to proceed with this issue, but telling me tonight they are accepting the city of Henderson's proposal. HOA here was dragging their feet to an excessive amount, and uh, it took reaching out to the media to get anything done. Somerset Park resident Gordon Rossi saying he looked forward to speaking his mind at the Camco Home Management Company's meeting following years of problems. We have to hope for the best, and we have to hope that the people that they are going to have installed aren't going to be as bad as the people they've had fixed the repairs in the past. The closed door meeting for only those who live there seeking a solution to a three year long water main break. System failure has caused parking issues and water outages for the community's 85 units. Residents believe Camco would not have even addressed them had it not been for elected officials coming up with a solution. I feel like if the news outlets didn't catch a hold of the story, I feel like we just wouldn't have been uh, heard whatsoever. One of the proposals, the city of Henderson fronting costs up to $600,000 eventually paid back by Somerset residents through tax liens. Somerset's HOA given a September 10th deadline to sign off on the plan. I'm grateful for the opportunity to serve Ward 3 residents and um, I'm looking forward to this being resolved once and for all. Councilwoman Carrie Cox has been following the community's issues for months, saying residents invited her to support them at the meeting. There to support voices like Somerset resident Rick Martinez, who said he welcomes this support for his community. And I feel like going with the city would probably be the best bet only because um, I feel like Camco might be just going for the lowest bidder. Now, according to Camco, the H with company, the lowest bid heard tonight was for $1.4 million. The city of Henderson rejecting that bid, which means tonight we still don't know just who will fix the problems at Somerset Park. Reporting live from West Valley, James Schaefer, 8 News Now. James, thank you. In a statement tonight, Camco said they were seeking more contractor bids, but they were not allowed to continue the review process just yet because of the city's deadline to comply. That deadline is tomorrow. Denise?